So the Michigan Brown Trout Festival is a cultural event for all of Northeast Michigan that centers around the resources that we have here. Three or four anglers were picked to go out and catch big brownie or a number of them and then tag them. Uh, some years we had 10 of them and some were worth $100. Some were worth 150, and then the big one was worth 50,000. When we caught this fish, people realized what was out in that bay. The following year, the first of many annual brown trout festivals was held. Back in, I'd say, the early 90s, when the fishery was really good, we had for 100, maybe 150 boats. That's when it peaked out. At present, we're fishing maybe 24 boats. The whole bay is changing. The ecosystem is changing. And as fishermen, we have to change with it. And as a tournament, we have to change with what the fishermen need and want to get the fish. There will be almost no brown trout caught anymore, except those few that wash down from the watershed up above. Recreational fishing in Michigan is part of our heritage. A lot of people who grow up here grow up with that, that sense of enthusiasm for, don't tell me no, there's got to be a way that this will work. The festival is still popular, it's still well attended. I think by balancing out a little better has helped it survive. And I think that when the fishing comes back and the festival's still going, it'll end up being better than ever.